The train about to depart on Platform 2 is going to London. Cultural Centre of the Universe. Cultural Centre of the Universe? You've got to be joking. Well, that's all well and good for some people, but for others, London isn't such a highly regarded haven for children. Well, you know what it's like. Um, can I go to London, please? Certainly not. Could be kidnapped or anything. Besides, you haven't even finished your own work yet. But what are the alternatives? The neighbouring towns of Chesnut and Walsham Cross are North London towns, just 16 miles from the centre of the capital. For some, though, that might as well be 160 miles. It is a growing industrial area. Like many large towns in the area, Gordon was set in. But Paul Harris has found a cure over at the Walsham Cross Youth Centre. Are they sort of uh, encouraged to run activities or sort of come up with new ideas for activities? Well, both, probably. If somebody approaches one of the staff with an idea for a new activity, then they're most likely to find themselves being asked if they're prepared to organise it. I think its, it's main attraction probably is that it's, it's somewhere that's open in the evenings, um, where young people gather, and so the chances are that if you come here, you might, you'll either meet someone that you know, or even more attractive, more of an attraction, you might meet someone that you don't know. Um, this particular centre has, has got a sports hall attached, so um, that's exploited. And obviously a lot of the young people who come here then come because of the, the space available in the sports hall. This is the Wolf and Cross Youth Centre where quite a lot of youths in the area spend their evenings. And the first one I want to talk to is Debbie, she's a bit camera shy but she's agreed to ask her our questions anyway. Uh, do you see a wide variety of people at this centre from different backgrounds? Yeah, quite a lot. Uh, do they sort of come from a large radius outside the centre? Do you get them from sort yeah. of all around the area? Yeah, we feel all from everywhere. Um, what um, sort of first attracted you to coming to the centre? Um, my mate. So actually, you had friends here already, and sort of suggested that you came here. Yeah, well, my mate used to embed here you know, quite a lot. And uh, this is Steve, you and he's agreed to answer some of our questions. So, Steve, when does the uh, sort of centre primarily operate? Is it during the day or? No, it's mainly during the night, but it does during the day. It's sort of a variety of old people. What first attracted you to the youth centre? No, I just come down here and see what it was like, mate. Going to see it again. How would someone coming to the centre benefit from it? Do they keep it quite a bit? No, more sports than that. Just get a leisure of me. Different paper on that, I suppose. Yeah, well, I think I'll do for that one. That's great. Okay. Oh, thanks a lot. Okay, thanks a lot. Cheers. Hi. 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 Where are you going? Where are you going? Where have you been there? I've been to Walton Cross Youth Centre. Youth Centre? Yeah. It's really good. You want to come down now? It's still open. Yeah. Yeah, go on. Yeah, all right. Well, the youth centre might be good, but it hasn't got the shops. 